Isn't she lovely? Isn't she drop and stuff? <laughs> Look at her, she's so beautiful. Mommy. Mommy. What? Look at me. She's so beautiful. Alright, let me keep this stuff out here. Okay. They're leaving me, you guys. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Sha la la sha la 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 la. Sha la 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 la. You guys, my parents are leaving me. They're going on vacation without me again. <laughs> you know, good times, but that's all right. They have done their job. They have raised two beautiful daughters who are now semi, one more successful than the other, but for the most part, successful in life. And so now they get to enjoy it, right? You guys are going to be out here living your best life. See ya. Yes. Bye. We're going to be on our best behavior. <laughs> I'm living my dad. I'm living my best life. Yeah. We're not right. No, 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 no. Kids watch my channel. Absolutely not. <laughs> no. Bye. Bye. I love you guys. I love you too. I love you. So what finally happened, um, I missed yesterday's upload. I already posted about it on Twitter, and I was like, that just means that you guys are going to get double the upload today. So that's, I'm not going to do that right now. Right now, I'm still trying to finish up some, like, final homeworky stuff. Like, I'm so ready for this week to be over, you guys. You have no idea. But I'm uh, still trying to finish up some, like, final homeworky stuff. And then I have to film a video for somebody who I was supposed to give it to them, like, I think it was, like, last week. Um, but these past two weeks have been kind of hectic. And so I'm going to do that. Then I will edit my videos um, and then post them up. I kind of canceled all my plans for today because I just, I just have a lot going on. I need a rest day, so I called them at work. I was just like, I'm not going to make it. They was like, okay, you're, you're cool. Because um, thankfully, like the shift that I worked, I work, there's always like a lot of people. And so um, they were like, good. And I was like, cool. So yeah, right now I am heating myself up some left. Oh my God, I got so my eye. Anyways, like I said, right now I am heating myself up some food, some tilapia, rice, and french fries, which I don't know why they put those three things together, because I'm like, rice is a starch and potatoes, and I'm just like, you don't, those are both starches, you don't put those together. But anyways, uh, I'm heating that up to have that for breakfast, even though it's only 9.54 in the morning. So yeah, that's what um, I have planned for today. So today's going to be a pretty chill day. There's literally not going to be like, Sorry, my dog said something weird. Um, there's really not going to be anything like it, super exciting happening today besides me filming and editing and doing homework. So, yeah. Okay, guys. So, I'm actually on my way up to my school right now. I forgot that I have an interview for this study abroad trip that's happening next year. Um, I'm going to Taiwan next year, hopefully. I hope I'm going to Taiwan next year. And today, the interviews were supposed to happen yesterday, but they closed the school in honor of the president passing away. And so they were like, hey, we're rescheduling them today. Can you come in? I was like, sure. And I was in my room, and I just happened to lay down, and I fell asleep. <laughs> I woke up, and I looked at my clock. It was at 1.30. I was like, this appointment is at 2.10. So I got up. I got myself together. So I'm running a little bit behind, so that's why there's, I'm talking really fast in this clip is gonna be really short but I just want to let you guys know I'm about to go do my interview hopefully I do well hopefully they accept me right even though I'm not a psychology major I'm not a sociology major what a psychology minor I'm hoping they will accept me on this trip because I really 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 want to go all right let's do this thing Okay, so I'm back. Uh, I think the interview went pretty well. Hold up, let me, there you go. I think the interview went pretty well. Um, on my way back, I stopped at Starbucks because they were having their happy hour. So I got myself a venti caramel brulee latte, right? Because you guys know I now like lattes. But and then I also got like a frappuccino caramel brulee. Um, and I also got myself a cheese danish. Uh, yes, there is a bite taken out of it. This almost didn't make it home. But I was like, nope. You gotta have some content for your vlog, and this Danish is quality content. 
quality. <laughs> I'm going to keep doing what I was doing before I left. Editing, homework stuff, just getting my life together. In preparation for tomorrow, I'm going to take you guys with me when I go to my writing group. That'll be fun. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm probably not going to vlog, excuse me. But I'm not going to vlog while I'm there because it's awkward for me to vlog in public. But I will try to get some, like, candid shots of our, like, work work area. And we'll just see how that goes. But like I said, for now, I my goal is to get up my two vlogs from yesterday and the day before up today. Yeah, up today. So basically, you guys are going to get dick. Oh my god, I thought that was about to fall, man. But I would have been like, I would have been like, I'm so sorry. Let me not stand over here. Anyways, let me get back to what I need to do before I break something that I can't fix. I think I guzzled this down way too fast, and now I am slightly buzzed. Like, what is this? Uh, 1.8% alcohol by volume. I mean, that's not a lot, but I also had a cup and a half of Moscato beforehand. No, I'm not an alcoholic, but... <laughs> It's just one of those days this week has been stressful. Oh, there goes the oven. So, yes, if this vlog from this point on gets kind of woo, you guys know why. The first time I ever got drunk, I was 16. <laughs> and uh, we were out at a cabin. And all of my friends were older. Like, they were like... 19, 18 years old. I was the young one, but I always hung out with a group of older friends. And they were just like, oh yeah, you can have a drink. Sure, I'll teach you how to make a mixer. My dumb self, she, okay, when I got taught how to make a mixer, she was like, you pour in like three, like four fifths soda, and then like one fifth vodka. My dumb self did the exact opposite, and I did like four fifths vodka and one fifth soda. It was disgusting, but 16 year old me was just like, This is what the cool kids do, I should do it too. And so, nine of those later, I was gone, fam. I was done <laughs> for the night. I was so hung over the next day, like, literally, when we tried to walk down to the lake. <laughs> There was like a hill that makes you go up it and then you walk to the lake. Me and this other girl could not walk up that hill. We kept falling and rolling backwards. <laughs> oh my god, those were good times. <laughs> and let it be known that this all happened at somebody's birthday. Like to this day, every time I talk to her and I mention, or somebody mentions, alcohol they're just like not around Deja because she might get drunk on your birthday and I was like shut up I do not drink at people's birthdays because apparently I might be a little bit of a lightweight the only good thing about that is that I feel like like I've, I've drunk quite a bit at points in time but thankfully I don't get hangovers I've the only time I ever got a hangover was that one time when I was 16 but besides that I've never had a hangover before I should not drink this laying down because I feel like it's about to come back up. Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm up. <laughs> it's only been about, what, like 15 minutes since I started drinking this? Hmm. If there's anybody underage watching this, don't, don't do what I do. Do as I say and not as I do. Did not grow up to be an adult like me, but I'm not an adult. I don't consider myself an adult yet. I quasi adult all the time. <laughs> but anyways, my pizza is done cooking. I have to wait until it cools off, but it's about to go 
in my bed. <laughs> I'm a lightweight, apparently, because one of these is enough to make me feel very happy. And I feel like stuff is moving around me, but I know it's not. But my brain is just like, are you sure about that? And I'm just like, yeah, I'm sure. Am I? Yeah, I'm sure. This stuff's not moving. And I'm watching Pirates of the Caribbean right now. <laughs> ah! Guys, I'm feeling some type of way. I feel like I'm going to be super embarrassed by this later on. But I'm still going to post it because authenticity auth is that the word authenticness auth I was saying it right Authent authenticity I had I don't know why that was so complicated Buster. but my dog is looking at me like what the hell is wrong with her <laughs> be like if you were a human you would understand but anyways my goal at this point is to stop knocking stuff over I knocked over the hot sauce and I was so scared that it was gonna bust I got it. We got hot sauce. Oh shit. Excuse me. We got hot sauce, you guys. Red's hot. Red hot. Red hot. Hot sauce. This goes on the counter. And I'm ready to indulge in some delicious pizza. I'm so sad right now. My package didn't show up. Like, I don't, like, okay. If you say something is going to be here on a specific day, and it's not going to be. The least you could do is send me some type of... I even signed up for the thing that sends you notifications if something is wrong or a delayed packaging, stuff like that. And I'm like, I signed up for it, but I went on your website and it still said that my package should be delivered today. Fam, it's 11.37 p.m., my package is not being delivered tonight, okay? It's just not, right? The UPS store is closed. They closed, like, three, four hours ago. So, if there's some type of delay with my package, let me know so I can plan accordingly. Because now I got to rush back here to my parents' house from work tomorrow and hope the package has gotten there sometime in the morning slash early afternoon so that way i can go and be on time to my riding group and my leg is twitching i don't know why my leg is twitching this is weird i will say that i am thoroughly thoroughly enjoying living on my own and by living on my own i mean like temporarily i almost said permanently in my parents home this is so much more enjoyable than living with boys Oh my god, my roommates, if I could, I'd kill both of them and just have the house to myself so that way I can do with it when I wanted to, but I can't do that. Okay, so apparently, like, I'm running out of space on my phone. I don't know why, considering, why am I taking my glasses off? I don't know why, considering I, like, purged this thing, like, early, I think I purged earlier today. You gotta be able to concentrate on stuff. Oh my god, look at my eyes. Well, this is not a high enough definition to see it, but oh my lord. Oh, God, I mean, my eyes hurt. Uh. <laughs> oh my God, I'm drunk on camera. Okay, it's official. I'm drunk, but I don't care because I got my pizza. <laughs> it's so good. I already posted on Twitter that if you guys watched my vlog, this vlog, my next this vlog, which I will be posting up tomorrow, and you realize that I'm drunk. Oh, no, I already told you. If you, hold on, there's words that comprehend and go in the right places. If you guys know, just don't, just don't judge. Don't judge me right now. I will probably be judging myself later on. When I come back and look at this. But. Don't judge me guys. Oh my pizza. And I have crumbs in my neck rolls. Um, ow. <laughs> I didn't realize my face was that close. Hold on. 
God, I still got crumbs in my neck roll. Oh, I read this post on Twitter. They were like, people who vlog, do not, <laughs> do not look at your viewfinder. Look at the actual camera. And I realized when I went back and watched some of my videos, oh, I do look at the viewfinder a lot. That's because I want to make sure that I look gorgeous for you guys. Right? I don't, like, want to film and then come back later and look at it and be like, what, what was going up at your face? Like, why is it like that? So, of course, I'm going to look at my viewfinder quite often. One, because I'm a sexy-ass human being. <laughs> and... Oh, fuck. Two. My bad. I forgot. You have to one. Oh, my God. Ah! And one, two, because I want... I was going somewhere with this. Oh, like I said. Oh, shoot. I keep underestimating the distance between my hand and my face. Um, Two, I want to look nice for you guys. I got a piece of sauce on my shirt. Dude, if anybody ever gave me a like a jar of dirt and was like, here, I'd be like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> drunk texting people is not a good idea. Do I drunk called my ex one time? Hold on, my laptop's about to fall. Let's not have that. I drunk called my ex once and asked him to prom. Was it prom? Yeah, and asked him homecoming? Prom. And he was like, oh, I'm already going with this other girl. I can't fucking stand her. And to this day, I cannot stand her. I, whoo, there's a whole story behind that. Maybe one day I'll, like, tell you guys it. But anyways, he was like, I'll save you the last dance. And I was like, I, <laughs> I didn't remember it the next day. And so when prom rolled around and the DJ was just like, this is the last song. He came up to me. He was like, I said the last dance for you and me. They get me and the homeless romantic I am. I was like, oh my God, this bitch left me. <laughs> but then my friend was like, no, did you, you call him? Remember? I was like, what you talking about? They was like, you called him and asked him. And I was like, oh, for real? They was like, yeah. I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> and so that is how I ended up slow dancing with my ex at prom. <laughs> It was a good time though. So I must go to sleep now because I have work tomorrow. And so I will catch you guys on the flip side. Bye. I apologize like for my behavior last night. I felt it coming on and I felt the need to warn you guys beforehand that it was going to start going downhill. And I also realized that I never actually ended my vlog from yesterday. So this is my official ending. Thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys next time sober. I'll catch you guys next time while sober. For yourself.